On Sunday, President Jerry Museveni and the Kenyan Deputy President William Ruto commissioned the upgrade of the 73-kilometer Kapchora Saumo border road, which is expected to increase trade between Uganda and Kenya. The road, which will be constructed by the China State's Construction Engineering Corporation Limited, with a loan from African Development Bank worth 268 billion shillings, is expected to be complete in 36 months. While launching the road construction, President Museveni urged the people of Sebei region to consider planting commercial crops that they can sell across the border and increase their household incomes. That's why I have advised you in the manifesto of 1996, please let the maize be grown by those with a big piece of land. You with a small piece of, of land grow coffee. Kenyan Deputy President William Ruto revealed that the construction of the road to Sauma border in Kenya is going to increase the trade between Uganda and Kenya because of the East African common market. And therefore make it possible for both people in Uganda and people in Kenya to work together, do business, increase trade, expand investment, and make sure that the prosperity in Uganda is shared by Kenyans and the prosperity in Kenya is shared by the people of this great country. Minister for Works and Transport Engineer Monica Azuba noted that the road is a transformative project that will contribute to the social economic development of the region. Road construction in this area is a big challenge due to the mountainous terrain, also the lack of good gravel, that is marrow, and the poor foundation soils that are largely of clay. President Museveni, along with Kenyan Deputy President Ruto, also laid a foundation stone at St. Peter's Cathedral Sebei Diocese, where Museveni bought two bulls at 400 million shillings as contribution to the construction of the cathedral, while Ruto, with his delegation, contributed 10 million shillings. The glory of God, you can give a clap to the Lord, and you can say praise.